It sounds like you are O negative blood type and you were given Rogam during your first pregnancy and every woman who has a negative blood type should receive Rogam around 28 weeks and then what, what happens is they test your baby's blood after delivery. They don't have to poke your baby for this. They get a sample from the umbilical cord and test it. And if the baby also has negative blood, then you don't have to have another Rogam shot. So you can thank your baby for that. But if your baby has positive blood, then you receive another one. And if you have negative blood type and you're in a car accident or have any sort of bleeding episode during pregnancy, you're usually also given another Rogam shot at that time. And the reason for this is because if your body is exposed to a baby with positive blood, like the positive blood cells meet with up with your negative blood cells, your body will start to form antibodies against it and attack anything that has positive blood from that time forward. For this reason, you have to have Rogam during every single pregnancy. So you have a question specifically about your second pregnancy because your first baby was negative and you didn't get a shot after pregnancy. Do you have to have another one in your second? And the answer is yes, because we can't confirm that baby's blood type until after delivery. So at 28 weeks, another Rogam shot will be given and then the same thing will happen. After the delivery of your baby, they'll test your baby's blood and if it's positive, give you another Rogam shot and if it's negative, then you don't need another one. So the other part of this equation is dad. Um, if a woman with negative blood type um, has a baby with a man that has a negative blood type, then the babies will all have a negative blood type. Um, so if your partner knows his blood type, he has confirmation that he's also negative, then you can bring this proof to your doctor and your doctor may then at that point be okay without you getting a Rogam shot. Good luck with everything, and if you have more questions for me in the future, feel free to ask them on our Facebook page at facebook.com forward slash Intermountain Moms, and recommend us to your friends and family too.